it terrify you? Does it make you lose a breath? Does it make you believe that your Sims is about to go? Burst into a million pieces. Well, guess what? You is at the right place because I'm about to show you how to fix your problems. And you ain't gonna be worried no more. So stay tuned. Hello, Simple Gang. Welcome to my channel. We are back with another video. And today's video is gonna be a tutorial. I have not done a tutorial in like forever. I did tutorials when I first started this channel. And you guys kind of seem to like them. Um, so I was just like, why not do another one? If you want to see the rest of my tutorials, please go to the tutorial playlist where all of every single tutorial, all of them, every single one I did will be in there, including this one, so you can watch all of them so you can know what you're doing. So this tutorial is going to be about last exceptions. Yeah, you. that's right, I said it. I said it. I saw you, you in the back right there. Yep, you right there with the blue shirt. Mm -hmm. I saw you cringe when I, when I said that. It's okay, because I'm going to teach you how to fix it. So, what you're going to want to first do, well, first, first step is first, you're going to get your last exception in game. And it's going to pop up, and you're going to be like, what's going on? So, what you're going to do is you're going to want to go to this website here. This website will be linked in the description. So, what you're going to want to do is you can do two options. You can come here and you can go to your last session. Matter of fact, I got one today when I was playing Master Criminal. And you're going to upload it through that way now mine says the error has not been recognized and if they I don't know I guess they couldn't recognize whatever was going on and when I played earlier my game went completely fine so you can ignore it which is what it says here so you don't have to stop playing but if you are finding issues then you're going to have to figure it out. I'm sorry. Oh, my gosh. I can't believe I said that. But <laughs> there is no other way. Okay. So, um, my apologies, y'all. Origin decided to be the star of the show and, you know, kind of interrupt me. So, anyway, another way you can do it is you can go to your files go to your last exception and you can select all of this and copy and paste it and put it here and it'll do the exact same thing so you look control A to select all of it control C to copy it then you want to click here and control V and it's the same thing if I'm not mistaken, there was another website, but I don't know if it's like still here. If I can find it, I'll put it in the description. But it did the same thing, but I think the other one was a little more detailed. So how I, um, how mine said that there was no errors that they could find, I'm pretty sure the other one like broke it down to where you can like manually find it yourself but they'll still kind of like break it down and you can find out what's going on that way if you have mods in your game that could affect it you know like custom content all of that if you don't what I recommend is that you repair your game even if you do have mods you can also still do that option you can go to Origin, repair your game. I can't go to Origin right now because um, Origin wants to update. 
but hopefully I could put a picture here and tell you where to click like I could put pictures up to tell you how to get that and repair your game <laughs> is it for the video I hope I helped any issues that you guys could possibly be having if there's any more tutorials that you guys want me to do please let me know other than that don't forget to like comment and subscribe